All right, I just fucked this video up <laughs> because I got fucking, uh, I was fucking talking about Polacks. Well, I'm a fucking Polack, so fuck you guys. You made me stop that because it got fucking politically too incorrect, and I shouldn't even give a fuck, but uh, whatever. So I'm not a fucking review guy. I keep telling you that. But uh, here's another fucking review on another fucking movie that I fucking happen to love, all right? So I don't watch a lot of fucking movies. I, I'm a reali re reality TV show, except for that little Sheldon or young Sheldon or whatever the fuck it is. I love that show. Spinoff or the fucking Big Bang, uh, young Sheldon or whatever the fuck it is. I love that little kid that's in that is fucking badass. I love that kid. Does a great job. So anyway, oh, and Annie Potts is in it. Who doesn't love Annie Potts? Ghostbusters, fucking, uh, what was that fucking John Candy movie she was in? She was so hot in it. John Candy was fucking awesome, too. That was, uh, fuck. I love that fucking movie. I'm gonna find out what movie that was, and then I'm gonna fucking, I'll, I'll do something about that one, too, because fucking Annie Potts was fucking smoking in that movie. All right, but that doesn't matter. That's not what I'm talking about. So I'm the fucking reality TV show guy. And that's not even what I'm talking about because I watch a lot of Gold Rush. I can't wait for that show to come on every fucking week. And I'll tell you what, that fucking Parker Schnabel kid's got his fucking shit together. Motherfucker did 7,400 ounces of gold this fucking year. Like $9 million. He's like 20 fucking three years old. All them other fucking retards up there ought to fucking get their shit together because that kid's kicking everybody's fucking ass. And hey, Parker... If you ever fucking watch this shit and you want a fucking man to come up there and fucking run some machinery or shit, dude, I'll run the fuck out of an excavator and a fucking a payloader and shit. I, I do, I, I'll do, yeah, whatever the fuck. I, I'll pan some fucking gold for you. I don't give a shit. I'll pet your fucking dog. I think you're cool. And I don't give a fuck about nobody. So how do you like that shit? So anyway, that's not what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is this fucking movie I saw a few years ago. They did a sequel to it that is actually fucking pretty awesome also. It's a Tom Cruise movie. And I know some people are not fucking big Tom Cruise fans. But I got to tell you, I'm pretty sure I fucking like every fucking movie that Tom Cruise has ever fucking done. Especially since he got later in his career and started doing like the action films and shit like Night and Day. I could watch that movie six fucking times. I was actually in the field in Massachusetts where that plane crashed in that movie, by the way. I built power lines there because I'm a lineman. So anyway, fucking Tom Cruise, Jack Reacher. All right, finally I get to the name of the fucking movie, Jack Reacher, okay? If you haven't seen this fucking movie and you like a very fucking clear-cut, single fucking badass guy in a fucking movie movie, then fucking Jack Reacher is that. And you know what? the very beginning of that fucking movie where they they plot out how the fucking movie's gonna go through and they're looking for this Jack Reacher guy and they're like fucking oh blah 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 we can't find him and then he shows up and there's a little bit of fucking like quirky comedy dude that movie is fucking badass there's a fucking magic to that fucking movie that just fucking sets it apart and I gotta tell you, the second one is pretty similar. The second one's pretty fucking good, too. I really enjoyed both them fucking movies. Tom Cruise is in it, and then there's, uh... God damn it, what is her name? The fucking... It's the fucking district attorney's daughter. She's the fucking defense attorney in the fucking movie. I should know her name, because she's hot as fuck. All right? So, wicked nice cans. She's hot. So if she's watching this video, listen, you did that part right, okay? Sexy lawyer, you did nice. But uh, whatever. Hey, Tom, if you're watching this fucking movie, dude, I don't know if you like hang out and party or whatever, but dude, I'll fucking party. So anyway, that's not the point. Jack Reacher's a fucking good fucking movie. There's, uh, you know fucking intellect and fucking twists and turns and this and that and blah 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 fucking suspense and fucking action the part where he fucking ditches the fucking Chevelle or the fucking I think it's a Chevelle at the end of that fire well it's kind of in the middle of that movie but that movie's pretty badass yeah and fucking uh Robert Duvall's in that fucking movie too 
Yeah, he's good. I like his style. So, um, yeah, fucking Jack Reacher. Watch a fucking movie. And, uh, yeah, don't listen to some asshole fucking telling you to watch. Well, yeah, listen to me. I know what I'm talking about. I'm a fucking movie guy. I'm a huge movie guy. When I tell you to watch a fucking movie, you ought to fucking watch a movie because I've watched thousands and thousands and thousands. I don't watch football. I watch fucking movies. So fucking watch it. It's good. You'll fucking love it. If you don't like it, then go fuck yourself. I don't give a fuck. I'm just trying to fucking pass a fucking a boring Sunday afternoon or a fucking Saturday night. You're fucking too hungover from Friday. You don't want to go out or something. Or maybe you got fucking family over. Maybe you fucking got a girlfriend and you want to get her panties wet. Jack Reacher's pretty fucking good. I don't know. Whatever. That's what I'm telling you. Just fucking watch a goddamn movie.